Hi guys, I'm doing a video. Today we're making pancakes. And we got crispy treats at home. And this is all up. guys welcome and welcome back to another bliggity vlog it is October 31st <laughs> what's up baby hi now what's up with you It is October 31st, the last day it's of Halloween. October. It's Halloween. It is today, yeah. Happy Halloween, Mommy. Happy Halloween. Yay. Even though we don't celebrate no Halloween, it ain't no like happy Halloween, like, you know what I'm saying? It's Halloween, it's Halloween. It's Halloween. Hey, trick or treat to everyone. You gonna put on your dress? Gonna be dressed up all day? Yep. So all of them be a labor. Alright, so Capri crying because she had to get that little hand tap. She always is touching my product stuff. You grabbing the vinegar or grabbing grabbing a big old bottle of oil or something of that nature. And I keep on telling her, stop Capri. Capri don't ever listen. So she had to get that little hand tap. And when Capri cries, she be extra dramatic. Okay? Girl, 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 you just ate. Literally. Okay, here. I swear she just had two two full pancakes and two full pancakes and um blueberries. And now she wants some of my pancake. Bailey, was your pancake good? As you can see, Bailey made we was mixing up uh, her pancakes. We made a Halloween pancake like a Mickey Mouse. Did it look like a scary Mickey Mouse? <laughs> Y'all, I'm not creative. Hey, the, the cream look, look like a ballet. So, I wanted to end Vlogtober with the actual vlog. Mom, so that's what I'm doing today is vlogging. Is it Halloween? Today is, yes ma'am. Is it going down? It's all day, yeah. It's just a day. It's just another day. It ain't like Christmas or Thanksgiving where it's fun. Today is just a weird day, you know. The vibe outside is weird. Halloween ain't really um, godly, okay? It's, it's not godly. So, yeah. We don't really do no, no Halloween over this way, you know. No devils and monsters and all that mess, no. Mm -mm. I want to go better go somewhere the grocery store. <laughs> Happy Halloween! Anyway, so uh, as y'all can see, we ain't did nothing with Halloween this year. Uh, I never do. Bailey ain't never got dressed up like when she was 10 months. Not 10 months. She was 11 months. She was 11 months. So she, uh, I just like used to, when Bailey was a baby, I used to take her pictures every month. You know, when she turned a, another month on the 14th. So for Halloween, I just went and got a tiger outfit for her. She looked real cute. I'm gonna make sure I put the little clip here so y'all can see it. But she looked real cute, but um, 
I took that costume right on back because what's the point of having a costume if she's never going to wear it again, right? Took that right back. So just basically bought it just to take a picture and send it right back. So that's the thing about, uh, you know, Halloween and stuff like that. Like, what's the point in getting all fancy dressed up and stuff if they ain't doing nothing? In the house, we got a whole bunch of dress-up clothes upstairs, okay? Um, I was going to do boo at the zoo, but the weather's been trash. It's been raining literally every day this week, just about a thing. Um, hey, how many should be cheese? Halloween should be cheese. Halloween should be cheese, I said. But... The rain. It's been raining. So, today's not raining right now. It's gloomy. We'll see what the day holds. Literally, we're going to see what the day holds in this vlog, okay? Guys, Halloween. Because I just decided to pick up the camera with it being the last day of Vlogtober. And like I said, I'm ended up with a vlog. So, I'm vlogging. Y'all gonna get what y'all gonna get. <laughs> but, um, happy Sunday. I hope everybody has had a great weekend. Y'all are ready for November. I'm ready for November. November's a fun month because it's Bailey's birthday coming up. Like I said yesterday in my, uh, get ready with me. That I posted I will be uh, preparing and planning for Bailey's birthday this week. She wants to have a princess party with Peppa Pig, like theme, cake, and some of that. So that's what it's gonna be. She wants to dress up. I'm pretty sure I mentioned that. Hey, the Halloween one. Uh, then of course Thanksgiving. Uh, I love Thanksgiving just because, of course, being with my family. But when it comes to, like, the eating part, it's like we have this food all year round. There's certain things that we don't have that we only have, like, on Thanksgiving, it seems like. But most of the stuff is... I love you. I love you. Ah. So, most of the stuff is, um, you know, stuff that we eat throughout the year. Uh, except for our whole turkey, but of course we eat in turkey breasts and turkey legs and all that type of stuff. Uh, it's just coming together for me, you know. Coming together, getting full. You know, when you're full, you get to getting silly and laughing and stuff. Or is that just me and my family? <laughs> when we be full, we will laugh until we got tears coming out of our eyes, okay? That's just our family though. Like we are a vibe as a whole family. Um, where we just love to laugh, love to have a good time. Like it's just always laughter, and it ain't no look like no quiet laugh. Like, <laughs> nah, it's <laughs> that type, okay? And then of course I'm always the crazy one, so it's always a good time. So I can't wait for Thanksgiving to come together as a whole family and just enjoy each other's company. Even though we do that a lot, but you know. So I'm about to eat my breakfast, drink my coffee. I got my mug that says grateful. Y'all can't see that. It ain't it ain't it ain't zooming in, but a perfect mug to start off and end October and go into Thanksgiving because we don't need this light on. Because we're thankful. We don't even need that light on for I just need to open up the blinds. So I'm about to um eat and drink and i'm gonna check y'all in a minute all right guys so i just now walked up out the house i'm about to go see my homegirl ashley um who i went and kicked it with when i did that get ready with me for her birthday so today is her actual birthday she's a halloween baby happy birthday ashley okay even though i told you um so i'm gonna go gift her with some her natural products what did i gift her with let's see she loves my hair bars, okay? So I gift her with a hair bar. If you have not had my hair bars, if you don't know what a hair bar is, a hair bar is a yoni soap, okay? It's made with all natural ingredients, all right? Um, the ingredients is, of course, water, palm oil, coconut oil, um, yogurt, apple cider vinegar, rasul clay, aloe vera, and aloe, olive 
oil. <laughs> Look, I'm looking at it, and it. You know, you know how your brain and your lips just don't, you know, work together yet. So those are the only ingredients that's in it, but it is, when I say literally the bomb, people be ranting and going crazy about it. A lot of women be like, girl, I can't even say what a lot of women be saying, but they be loving it, okay? But some women even, like, if they're working outside, like in the summertime, or working, like, at a job where they're doing a lot of sweating and stuff, they realize, like, there's no odor, okay? Everybody is going to have some type of odor unless, like, you know you know but if you're using a, a a a feminine wash that is got fragrance in it it's going to mess up your ph uh balance it is going to possibly cause you a yeast infection uh, bacteria vaginosis um urinary tract infection just all of that like those little summer's eves and all of that stuff that's not natural is not good for you so even people like i use dove dove still has hidden ingredients in it like dove still has chemicals these chemicals or these ingredients that i have in my products is all eatable everything you can eat okay so that lets you know if everything you can eat okay anyway uh so yeah so check out her natural her bar actually i will be making some today i got a stock but um i still got some in stock but they dwindling down but people love my hair bars i love my hair bars you are odorless all day long not a peep of odor is going to come through unless like i said <laughs> okay um no no yeast infections like none of that you're not going to have any issues with your lady parts unless <laughs> okay i also I, as i said what products do you want you know so she wanted some miracle cream so i got her some miracle cream uh she's been rocking a lot of protective hairstyle so she don't need nothing else really and then also told her, i said you take baths you can get one of my yoni bath bomb yoni soaps i also have the bath bomb yoni soap with the bath bomb yoni soap it's always best to keep it in this package because you don't want the herbs to just be floating around your tub it's gonna be making it hard for the herbs to be picked up after you take your bath all that you don't want your your um your tub to get clogged because of the herbs so if you get one of these just make sure like you leave it in the the little bag so you take out the you know unwrap it but then you put it back in the bag and then you drop it in your tub and then it just dissolves and this also has apple cider vinegar in it which apple cider vinegar you know what i'm saying keeps that ph balance you heal me you heal me you heal me all right anyway i'm over here just chit chatting with all y'all like i ain't got nowhere to be so i'm about to go check out ashley for her birthday and um let's go and just in case y'all was wondering why my lips is looking so good because i got on that boss lady by blue expression so make sure you go check her out y'all come through come through with it y'all see those lips come through with it <laughs> what mm-hmm yeah feeling real moisturized right now you feel me all right i'm here at ashley's house there she go. Hey, happy birthday. You, you look so beautiful. Oh my God. You got to beat your face on already? No. Girl. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, <Yeah>. Alizina. <laughs> she done decorated, got her little pumpkins. <laughs> That's what I'm talking oh, about. Hi. Oh, my friend come to see me. Hi. My best girlfriend. <laughs> Happy Hi, birthday! Thank you. Little something. You are so pretty. Oh my God! Do I just like yeah? <laughs> okay. Come in. Come in. Oh, that's a pretty bouquet. That's real pretty. Sausage? Huh? Thank you, Sappy Tappy. You said what? Thank you, Sappy Tappy. He says, Thank you, Sappy Tappy. Thank you, Sappy Tappy. Aww. Let's see your dress, Bailey. Who are you supposed to be dressed up as? 
it's not white. Oh, let's see. How lovely. Learning. Oh, Capri. How beautiful. Who are you supposed to be, Capri? Lady. Say Minnie Mouse. Minnie. Oh, okay. Stop spinning. Other <laughs> steps. All right. I, 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 oh, 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 Jesus. All right, guys. We're up in Walmart. Look. I had to get me a patty pie. I got to see what this patty pie working with. Bailey wants some cookies. Yeah, cookies. Capri's face ain't washed. Bailey, she wanted to take off her jacket because she wanted everybody to see her outfit, so yeah. that's where we are right now. All right, come on. Let's go. What they got for sale over here? All right, guys, so we are trying to look for some paint so that the kids can do some arts and crafts when we get back to the house. That's what I really came out here for with some paint. What is it? Jumbo watercolors. What is that color right there? Let's see. All right, so I finally found the paint. What is this? Oh, washable. Oh, this paint looks nice. So we could go with a black. Take that. Because we need it. And what, what color does this got in it? This is the green. Guys, this is the We got some ideas over here. For Christmas, for sure. Uh, this possibly birthday. Come on. What's up, y'all? I'm back home. Um, Capri, as you can see, she was knocked out. Okay. Back home, we kept, went to Walmart. I just wanted to pick up um, some painting stuff so that we can do like an arts and craft, you know, for the day or whatever. So, ended up getting some of these. Got some paint. Those colors. Got some paint. Had to get some dish liquid because of those bubbles that we made. Pick up a lot of my dish liquid. Got some little eyes for our little ghost that we're gonna make. Got some French toast bites because Bailey loves French toast bites. Y'all know that in the morning time we were all out. Pick up some ice cream, which we about to eat on right now. Yeah, go potty. Take it off. Yeah, you can. I also got Bailey wants some cookies, so she got some cookies. Uh, I want me. I never had a patty pie before, but after seeing y'all eating these patty pies up on here, I'm like, let me go ahead and try this patty pie and see what the patty working with. Okay. And then just some syrup for pancakes, whatever. So. That was all I got. I didn't even get a chance to show y'all what I got over at um, Kroger. Because there was nothing really to see. I'm about to prepare dinner. It is 5.30. Somebody prepared dinner. I'm actually right on time because that's when I wanted to prepare it. So that we could eat like about 6 o'clock. If I start at 5.30, then, I mean 6.30. The meal should be done about 6.30. So I'm making baked chicken legs and uh, some scalloped potatoes. Oh. I forgot, I also got this because I ain't doing very many dishes tonight, okay? So the chicken and the scalloped potatoes will be one of this. And um, 
some asparagus and the girls will get some green beans. So I'm about to get Bailey some ice cream right now so she can stop bothering me about ice cream because she didn't say about five times. I told her, I said, I'm an adult, okay? You just gotta tell me something one time. You ain't gotta keep on telling me something over and over, okay? Tell me something one time, that's it. Hi guys, hi guys, I got some ice cream. smock she got on her smock like i said a little smock this is for her age but she wanted me to wear one so i got it on we got our paint here our water so we're gonna do a finger paint um we're gonna do this right here let me show y'all all right so you want to do this one or this one we would do this one okay is that four fingers yeah I didn't gonna paint it. Alright. Y'all see that? I didn't gonna paint it. That's what we're gonna recreate. Oh, do we? We to you was I told you wasn't with me waking up. I need to I need to done as y'all can see everything is laid out fried died and laid to the side you feel me um i'm about to get the girls once we eat dinner they'll be getting into the bath prepared for the night bed is about 7 30 so dinner's taking a little longer than i expected well dinner did take a little longer than i expected but i'm so glad it is the last day of october which means Vlogtober is over with, okay? I'm really proud of myself for uploading every single day. It was pretty challenging sometimes, not all the time, but just sometimes. Thinking about content to create or um, when I'm gonna edit, you know, cause I would edit at night, as y'all could tell, my videos started coming later toward the night because I had to make sure work, the kids, the house, we ate, all that type of stuff was done before I could play, okay? Um, what else? Another thing that was like kind of challenging was since I am a business owner, creating content for my business page for IG because I was so busy creating content for YouTube. Um, even though the sales still continue to come, thanks a lot to y'all from YouTube who have been rocking out with her natural. I appreciate y'all. Um, but yeah, so I noticed that my business started to slack off when it came to creating content for Instagram. Um, what else? Am I going to do Vlogtober? I mean, Vlogmas? Mm, I don't know. I honestly don't know. I probably will. I did see my numbers going up when it came to subscribing because of the uh, Vlogtober. So that was a plus. But if you have a business, let me know. Did your business, did you continue to still strive with your business where it came with content? Or did you slack off on content? to focus more on YouTube. 
I thought, you know, I could do it all, but I was really tired. And then another thing too is feeling, not feeling overwhelmed. So some people may feel overwhelmed because of it. I don't allow myself to feel overwhelmed. If I see comments and stuff and I am tired right now, I'm not going to respond. I'm not about to get overwhelmed. I will respond when I feel like over responding. So because of that, I guess that's procrastination kind of right. But because of that, um, I got a lot of messages to respond to. A lot of emails. My emails is crazy. Like business emails that I got to respond back to. It's, it's a lot. So I will probably do that tomorrow. So tomorrow y'all will not see, y'all will see this video tonight, but tomorrow I won't be posting. I'll probably take a week off from posting just so that I can do everything I need to do when it comes towards business and all that. So we'll see, but I, I enjoyed Vlogtober. I appreciate you all for watching every 31 videos. Okay. Um, shout out to, like I said, all the ones who did do Vlogtober. Shout out to y'all. I see y'all growth. I see, um, you know what I'm saying? I'm just seeing your creativity, all that. So, shout out to y'all. But, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this vlog. Because, like I said, I got to get the kids together. We're about to eat. Um, bath. Bed. Okay? Uh, we did our painting. So, today was a chill day. But, still try to make it a little fun. You know? I always try to make a day fun. But, like I said, guys. I appreciate y'all rocking and rolling. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you also like. I was eating. And also comment. I'll catch y'all in the next video, which won't be tomorrow, okay? <laughs> it will not be tomorrow. But I will catch y'all in the next video. Bye, guys.